Hey everyone, I'm just coming here to give you guys a recap of my month and kind of just feeling like where I'm at and what I feel like I'm doing so far. Um, with the eclectic visuals for YouTube, I feel like I've done such a good job so far. Um, I am striving to get more views, um, striving to get more engagement, followers, all of those things. My goal right now is to at least hit 100 followers, and um, hopefully I can do that by the end of June, which is starts today. So I'm a little late on giving my recap, but <laughs> it's whatever. Um, the other thing is that I have been personally trying to learn how to um, look at things from a positive set of lenses. Um, every day you wake up, you, you can either choose negative thoughts um, or struggle to create your reality or, or manifest in your reality eventually. Uh, I'm learning how to choose how to utilize joy and inspiration. So I found myself being inspired, of course, by like going on walks and looking at the clouds and how they form and sunsets are really beautiful. Um, the colors in the sky that come from sunsets become beautiful. Just kind of discovering things, listening to the birds sing. Um, those are some of my favorite things to do or, or be around. Um, and I also have been learning how to communicate more. Um, and that I am trying to communicate to a level of where it doesn't cough, come off as mean, but it can be firm when it needs to be. And also communicating when it's a positive thing. Because people and yourself also need to recognize when something actually is positive in your life. There's so many things I am grateful for um, this past month. I am grateful for my YouTube channel. I'm grateful for my family. I'm grateful for my supporters. Um, I'm grateful for the newcomers who have been showing some love. I really appreciate you guys. Um, I'm appreciative of me taking myself seriously and being more confident in that. I love being in this way. Um, I'm also very grateful for discovering new inner works that I can um, start implementing into my life. I feel like I learn something new at least every day or every other day. Um, or I also just keep reminding myself of the things that I know about that process as well. Because it's always helpful to have something like consistently, you know, programming you in that aspect. I, I, I don't know what other word to use, but um, deconstructing and deprogramming negative beliefs and negative thoughts that I once used to carry into my life to the point where now I am catching myself with a negative thought and be like, okay, you need to, you need to stop there, breathe, do whatever, stop whatever you're doing. Um, or allow yourself to think about something that makes you feel even just a little bit better. So I am really grateful for all of the experiences that I have been encountering this last month. It's been really great. I am looking forward to this month. There is a couple of things that I'm excited for. Um, number one, Juneteenth festivals. I love seeing um, our history and our culture and the, the way people bring awareness to it and the way they bring awareness to Juneteenth specifically. Um, I love how we celebrate ourselves. I love all of, the, all of the things. It just feels like joy and knowledge coming to you. Um, there's some other things about summer, like summertime events and things that are coming up. So I'm really excited about that. And I hope you guys are too. I can't wait to show you guys once we do it. But um, yeah, I think that's about it. Just staying grateful, um, learning how to be positive, learning how to shift my perspective. Um, I think the one thing I want to learn or I want to focus on in uh, June is not allowing myself, well, I don't want to say it like that. I want to learn how to manage my thoughts a little bit better as far as overthinking 
things and situations that may occur in my 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 reality. Um, the reason being is because um, I am the creator of my reality. So whatever I is being shown to me or whatever I feel like it's being done to me, it's a reflection of my thoughts that I have thought in the past. So I have to figure out how do I move forward. And I think I figured it out. I'm just I'm I'm wanting to keep myself in a consistent state of remembrance of who I am and a consistent state of remembrance of positive thoughts that I could choose um, and being able to kind of distract myself with positive things in my life that are going well and that I know is coming and it, even though it doesn't look like it in the reality right now I just know it's coming and just keeping that faith and belief system stronger than ever so yeah that's about it I got um if you guys have any questions or comments below if there's some things you want me to shoot or film put them in the uh, comments below I'd be happy to review and see what I can do peace out yeah, I'm a millennial. <laughs>